That was a good one, guys, right? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Guys, if you are new here, you are welcome. Oh, geez, welcome back, guys. Thank you for supporting my channel and the other channel, guys. The Pisces channel. If you are a Pisces, guys, that information is listed below. I think it comes up as a link. If not, cut and paste, right? Just cut and paste and get it. All right, guys. But it is called the Pisces channel, one word. Like, just the Pisces channel, just one word. And you'll see two little fish, like um, two little betas. One's red and one's blue. So if you see that, that's me, right? And you'll see this table. You'll see my hands and all that. So come and support your girl. Come and come, come get your life. I did a lot of readings for Pisces today, actually, this morning, guys. Collective, what's going on, guys? Let's get it. This is a new deck. Hollow Heart. Hollow Heart. Veneration, sensuality, gentleness, and nakedness. The Hollow Heart. Number 30. The Hollow Heart is... Let me make sure I got the right one. And see, I didn't have the right one. See? The hollow heart. Okay. It says hollow heart. Veneration, sensuality, gentleness, nakedness. Can you say... You work with courage when you are deep within the depths of darkness. Can you say you are worthy of devotion if you hesitate at the sight of your own naked body in the mirror? Can you say you are powerful in your sensuality when you lay yourself down to sleep at night? A wise person knows her worth from within as she basks naked under the moonlight glow. Her story is written in poems as lines along her curves and she surrenders to the waters of life and love. Maybe you relate to this woman, or perhaps you feel you don't. But every being, both male and female, in the world has a feminine essence. And it is this very femininity that empowers the touch of creative intuition. Without gentle sensuality, all magic of love and affection become impotent of divinity and grace. Blessed is the being who cracks the heart open to release the ocean of love that wells within them. When combined with the energy of fire, you are ignited in the sacred force of womankind, unable to be drowned out. When combined with earth, you become the voice of the brown mother with her children of trees, flowers and plants unable to be cut down. When combined with air, you shift into the divine song created by the goddess, unable to be silenced or suffocated any longer. There is power in vulnerability and wisdom and self-care. It is time to reclaim energy you have spent over the days and years and to restore your inner powers to youthful form. Your capacity to love the world is greater than even you thought possible to feel the lion's roar within as he commands you to crack your heart open and let this moment seep into your bones as you remember your magical, your magical worth in spirit and skin. So does the heart become holy. So guys, spirit wants you to know that regardless of what you've been through, you're still lovable. You're still sacred. Spirit wants you to be vulnerable to love, right? And guys, to allow yourself to love. That's definitely for the feminists because I know sometimes we'd be down in the comments and be like, F them, F them, F that. You ain't got no chance in hell. Guys, do not let that harden your heart, Okay. Do not let it harden you, collective. Spirit said, reach back to your sensuality, your nakedness. Go look at yourself in the mirror. Find your femininity. <laughs> Holy Spirit, Holy Air. So here we have for the collective. So you have a hollow heart right now. You're not feeling love. Yep. What is this? You could have, you could either be hopeful for something to come in or you could have turned your back on something. Well, I think you're hopeful. If spirit winds up right, Queen of Pentacles, that's you, right? So your heart could be hollow right now. I mean, you're doing good in and of itself. Your money's coming in, your abundance is coming in. You're in Seven of Pentacles. You're out in the yard picking from your own damn money tree. Like, you're doing well. You're the Queen of Pentacles and your shit's still coming in, right? It just is, but your heart is hollow. It's like, you know how sometimes people get their heart broken. And this is a feminine read. It just is. And you could be a male and still be feminine. 
But you know how sometimes you just love and 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 you get your heart broken and then you just go forth with education, with school, with this. Like you do something to where it just takes you to a whole other you, right? Some of you could have started a business, got a new job, got your degrees, but whatever it is, you just kept going and going and going. Something in life pushed you forward and you just kept going, but your heart is hollow. Like what's missing is the love. It's almost like you're vulnerable. Yep. Ten of cups in reverse. Somebody broke your heart. Ten. Somebody broke your heart. You did. Ripped it right out. You did. Look. Oh, my God. I said ripped it right out. And look at this card. Somebody ripped your heart right out. You see? it? There's your heart right there. Somebody ripped your heart right out, collective. And right now, I think you've jumped hard and cold. And Spirit's like, no. Bring that sensuality back. Right? Bring that femininity back, right? Don't be cold. Don't don't turn your heart cold, Spirit said. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. You could have found out about another person. Yep. You found out about another, another person. Somebody was going and dipping it and giving it to somebody. But what's funny is this person now wants to come back. The towers in reverse. Somebody wants to come back, right? But they hollowed your heart, baby. What are you going to do? Yeah, there they are. Eight of Cups in reverse. They want to come back. Now, you may be up in your head about this decision. Because, see, your life took off after this person left or whatever. Like, you're in a different space. You're, you're busy. You're in the public eye. You do something right? Six of Wands, things are looking great for you. Everybody's watching you, right? So now they want to come back, but now you're thinking twice about it because you're like, hey, you already broke me before, so why am I, why am I going to sign up for that again, right? You found out about a child's mother. Either that or you found out that somebody went and had a baby. Spirit, who is this Empress in reverse? And for some people, some things, some things people just can't get by. It's a magician in reverse. This person could have been trying to do magic on you and it didn't work because maybe they know that their person wants to offer you this two of cups again, this king of swords who's lying to you in reverse. Since they see you as the ace of pentacles, they see you as a gift, a gift from spirit. But the only thing is this person is lying to you about the baby's mom, but the baby's mother know about you because they try to do magic on you to prevent this love thing. Yeah, this person wants to come back and offer you their two of cups. They give us the death card in reverse. They just don't know what to say to you. Page of Pentacles in reverse. They don't know what to say to you. So your heart is hollow, collective. Spirit mm -mm -mm. says, don't let it be. But I know right now you're focusing on you. It's all about you. Because you know, although they're trying to come back, you know they didn't put any work in the first time, right? And you remember the first time you didn't follow your intuition and you said, I'll never do that shit again, right? That's what you said, collective. Yeah. You're over here. You're happy now. You're doing you. You're celebrating. You're with your friends, your family. You're living, right? And now they want to come back and you're like, I don't know, collective. Because this person hollowed your heart. I mean... You know, don't stay hollow. You don't have to be with this person. This is the King of Pentacles. And guys, yeah, don't take them back. King of Pentacles, Seven of Cups. So they still have a lot of options. And if you let them back, guys, they're going to do it all over again. Ten of Swords in reverse. Nope, this is a no. This is a no. This is a no. You have no regrets about not giving this person a second chance. You're not going to. You want balance in your life. You want peace. So you know with this person, it would be the four wands in reverse. You know there would be no stability here. You're not doing this again. Yep, there's your moon. Your moon said, pay attention. This is a uh, emperor in reverse. And this emperor in reverse, you don't have you don't want nothing to do with that. You don't want nothing to do with that. Nope. That's a joke. Lovers in reverse. Nah. Spirit said no. No, 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 no. You gonna stay busy. These cards are all mixed up now. It doesn't matter. I'm done pulling. 
All right, guys. So this person hollowed your heart. They broke your heart. They did to the point where you're not even vulnerable anymore. You're just like out doing it. But spirit said, don't stay in that space. I mean, you can, you can stay cold to this person, but don't stay cold in general. Uh, when it comes to love or giving to other people. But this person's going to try to come back, guys, and they're coming back with the same fuckery, right? So, no. Actually, let's do some 1 800 to roll on this, right? Let's do 1 800 to roll. Let's just see. Holy Spirit. Give us one. <laughs> Please cancel my subscription to your issues, right? You're going to cancel You're gonna cancel your subscription to this person's issues, right? You're done. You're done. It's all fun and game until it's your turn, guys. So I don't know what happened here. Either that or this person is going to feel it now. It's their turn now. Now it's their turn. Mm -hmm. It's their turn to feel the hurt, right? And the neglect. That was just too many. Yeah, believe in yourself more than you believe in anyone else, guys. All right, this person hollowed your heart. And they're going to try to come back to do it again. But Spirit said no. And I said no. So it's a no. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.